stays here. I don't want to see this. Keep reinforcing positive words, some key words for them to lock in and to remember is very, very important. Low up. Low up. Excellent, you bend your knees. And I want to see this coming in. Okay. Very nice. That was a good forward motion. Please like and subscribe if you want more videos like this. We're gonna start from this area, close to the net, and gonna go all the way back. What I'm looking for is your take back to be short, drop your racket a little bit, and bend your knees. You have to bend your knees. You can just stand and try to hit. One. Okay, this is too far back, your racket. Here, stay sideways. Good, wider stand, bend your knees. Now, it is the important part, if you can do it or not, okay? As the racket goes down, your legs go down. Go. See how it goes? Yeah. Okay, stop there. Stop. As now the racket drops a little bit, don't move your body. Okay, here. As the racket goes up, now your legs go up. Low up, low up. You understand? Yes. Where do you play your shot? Cross court. Where cross court? Short angle. Learn how to drop your racket and play top spin. Okay, let me see. Start from zero? No, one, yes. Where's your racket? I, I don't want your palm, the right palm, to cross your right hip. Okay. From here, you do this only. I don't want to see you going for a back. You don't okay. have to. Okay? Okay. Good. That's a great angle. A little bit softer. Be very mindful where's your right palm. Okay. Good job. So oh, you dropped. Okay, hold on. So I purposely I did that. When I drop the ball, first thing is to go back. Here, forward. Here, forward. Got it? Oh, okay. Very good. And stay calm. Don't squeeze too hard. Okay. Calm. Very good. Okay. Again. Yo. Oh, where is your racket? In front. Excellent, that's the one. Forward. Bravo, now you drop it correctly. Excellent, wow, look at the shape. Excellent, you bend your knees. Very nice. Excellent, be patient, look down. Do you have to look where the ball goes? No. Why? I don't know. Oh, you don't know, okay. I don't want you to look the ball. I want you to okay. measure the core. The core is not moving. Mm -hmm. It stays there. You want to go short angle, the ball is going to go short angle. Mm -hmm. I want you to get your racket back here. 45 degree angle here. You're going to meet the ball here. Stop there. Stop there. Bend your knee. Stop there. Where's your left arm? In front. Correct. Stays here. Okay? See how straight is your arm? Yeah. If you hit the ball here, very, very likely it's gonna go where you want to. Yes? Uh-huh. Okay, that's me. Yes, that's me. Excellent, more. Excellent. Okay, bend your back knee. Excellent, now you activate your legs, activate your core. You feel it? Yeah. Oh yes, I'm feeling it too. Here, a little bit close. You want to drop a little bit, see? It gets under. Here. Where's the contact point? In front of your knee. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yes. Quick. 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 You're brushing. Quick. Understand? Yes. All right, show me. Relax, relax. Act, relax your legs. Good. 
go. Very good. Don't look at the ball. Trust it. Oh. Your head only stays here. I don't want to see this. Okay. Okay? Okay. And I want to see this coming in. Okay. See if you can do it. Where's your racket? Good. You tried. Where's your left arm? Try. Excellent. Okay. You tried. Yes, nice. Drop a little bit. See okay. if you can do it. Very nice shape. Wow. Very nice shape. Excellent. A little bit closer your feet. Yes, comfortable. Very nice, Alex. Okay. I think you pulled too early your left. Okay. This is relax, relax, yes, relax, very good, relax, this is important, okay? Okay. Very good. Amazing. I turn my head. It's okay. See, now you're aware of it, okay? Amazing, very good. Again, a little more soft to the grip. Very relaxed, relax, very relax. A little bit here, okay? Go. Very good. Stop, don't move. This is a little bit too straight. Relax, 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 good. Relax, good. No tension. Ready. Very good. Amazing. Next progression, you start from the service line. Okay. You are going to come here, exactly the same area. Okay. You play exactly the same ball. Okay. okay? So I'm going to have like a little run? Correct. You're going to run. I want to see how you're going to run. I want to see how you're going to stop and how you're going to go back. I'm not going to give you the hint how to do it. I want to see how naturally you're going to do it. And then I'm going to try to structure it accordingly. Okay? Go. Good. That was great touch, very good. Very good. Okay. What can you do better or is very good? What do you think? I don't know. I don't expect you to know, but it's details what they're looking for. What you just did here, can you remind me statically what you did? Uh, I did this. Where's your left arm? In front and then goes back. Coming. Did you try to do it when you move? No. When you move forward, what position is your racket? One or zero? One. One. But you didn't move with a one, you moved a zero. One is out immediately. One, hold it. Yes. And then when you approach the ball, you separate. Okay. Okay? Go. Go. Again. Go. Good. Nice control. Go. Close your racket. Go. Very nice. Go. Adjustment step, go. Very nice control. Show me the left arm how well the elbow can come close to your ribs, okay? Okay. Go. Very nice. I'm looking one part at a time. Very good, you're trying. Go. Very nice. Keep the elbow to your ribs, the left. Better, go. Go. That was great rotation. Go. Very nice. Okay, relax. Do you understand? Yes. It was easier or harder? Harder. Why? Because you had to do the run. 
you have to move, all right, constantly. Yeah. Now it's multitasking. You move in is one part. Having a certain position in your racket is the other part. What you do after the contact point with your left and right hand is the other part. There's a lot of components now you have to put together. But I don't want to focus on this technical part and where to hit the ball. So you have one task, hit the ball short angle. So you don't have to overthink too much. We're gonna do it again. When you move here to the short ball, do you lean back or forward? Forward. Okay, how much forward? Like this much. I want pretty much your head to be over your toes. It, now many times you lean back. Your head is behind of your body actually. So let me see how you do without the ball. Go back and shout the swing. Go. Don't move your back foot. I want you to be able to decelerate and stop in here, controlling your body. Stop. Bend. Okay, keep your balance, go back again. You have to be in balance. Go. Where's your left arm? Straight, it comes just to bend. Go again. Straight. Yes, but you have to be in better balance here, okay? Go. Bend. Good. You have to put your weight here. Excellent, okay? Understand? Yes. All right, now hit the ball. Go. Stop. You lean back. Be patient, okay? I will slow down. Go. Stop. There you go. Go. That was great. Very good. Go. That's okay. Stay lower when you move. Go. Very nice. Go. Excellent. Now you understand how the movement. Yes. Do you do split step over there? No. Why? I was pretty much all the way uh, bouncing or kind of like doing something with my Do you do like... split step? No. Why? I didn't focus on that. Okay, that's fair. It's okay. Just take accountability of what you can do, what you cannot do. It's okay. I'm not gonna be on your case on that part. Okay, so let's add now the split step. Excellent. So when I give you command, go, you have to do a split step. Okay. And what you just did earlier, okay? The last five, six shots. Go. Do it again. Split step is wider. Okay. Go. Stop here, lean forward more, slow down. I give you plenty of time. Nope, I'm not ready. Go. Very good. Go. Very good placement. Don't stop, don't stop. Keep moving, don't stop. Continuous movement. Go. Lean more forward with commitment. Go. Very nice. Go. That was great. Go. Excellent. Lean more forward. Go. Very nice. Go. Very nice. Bravo, Alex. Go. Again. Lean more forward. Okay. I don't care how fast you will go back. All I care to take enough time to understand and then go back to the yo part, okay. okay? So when you're bouncing over there, what you're thinking? Uh, about nothing. Okay, <laughs> so I got you off guard. So last time, last lesson, we did something in detail that you have to pronounce. Yes. Do you remember? Yes. When you're bouncing right now, we're gonna do a similar situation, we're gonna activate your brain a little bit. You're gonna reinforce the positive information. So I want you to focus more in detail you to lean forward more with your upper body. Okay. So I'm going to say lean forward. I want you to say forward. Okay. Simple. One word. So when you bounce here, forward, 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 you're going. Okay. Okay? okay. And I want you to do it here where after hit the ball to be forward with your chest and your head. Okay. okay? Forward, forward, Go. forward. Okay, 
Just the chest. Don't in your head. Don't go over with your back. Okay. Don't worry about it. Forward. Forward. Go. Forward. Very good. Excellent. Forward. Forward. Go. Forward. It's okay. Stay low. Forward. Forward. Go. Forward. Very nice. Forward. Forward. Go. Forward. Excellent. You did it. Forward. 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 Go. Not enough. Yeah. Again. Even if the ball is low, you forward. have to bet under. Forward. Forward. Go. Very nice. One more time. Can you do more forward motion? Yes. Okay. Forward. Forward. Go. Forward. Again. Oh, split step. It's okay. Yes. Forward. All right, hold on. Relax. Forward. Is a split step a thing that I have to remind you or you have to remind yourself? Or it's becoming like almost automatic? It's be kind of becoming automatic, but I think I still need a tiny bit more uh, like... I'm okay with that. i give you a little more time. I don't want you to remind you a lot of information at once, but split step and bouncing one, two is always there. Yeah. So I don't want to keep reminding information that you've done since you stopped playing tennis. Yes. Let's go. Forward, forward. Go. Forward. Very nice. That was a good forward motion. Forward, forward, forward. Go. I love it. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, it's a progression. Okay, we're gonna get quick water and then you're gonna go back to the baseline to similar situation. Okay. Okay? Okay. All right. I really like how to mess up with his brain a little bit. And like I, I have to think how to make him to build the muscle memory and also for him to repeat himself. Then I don't have to repeat myself as a coach. I want them to be accountable and to take initiative. Is a, is a practice, it's not a match for him to get distracted in the other opponent or someone else. It's him and the ball and the coach, nothing else. So keep reinforcing positive words, some key words for them to lock in and to remember is very, very important. So let's see when we go to the baseline if he remembers right away to do the right information. Let's see. Now, look, I'm going to go to the baseline. I'm going to ask you to move forward. You're going to start from there. Now the ball is going to be here. You're going to play short angle or three-quarter angle. Where is three-quarter angle? Uh, in the middle. Where is the middle? The, like right there, like a go, service walk, line. Walk. Tell me exactly. Like over here. Correct. So around this area is yeah. a three-quarter angle. Yes. Or you can play short angle. Okay. Yes. I purposely, this time, I don't have targets for you. I can easily put targets to see it, but I want to, you to picture the court where and how to measure the court and try to execute it. All right, let me see. Go to the baseline. Go. What you're missing? Split step. Okay. <laughs> Let, remind me what's supposed to do over there. Give me three things. Split step, bouncing. And Give me with priority. One, two, three. One is split step. You so you don't bounce before? Yes, bounce. So bounce first. Bounce. Split step. Yeah, what else? Give me one. Take thing. back. Take back. Okay, let's focus on those three areas now. Go. Okay. Go. That was amazing. Very good take back. Go. Again. I'm okay with that. Go. Go. Hold on. You missed all three shots. Did they say anything? What? Did they say anything? No. Did they criticize you why you missed the shots? No. No, because the three parts you told me you're supposed to do, you did very well. 
Now, how the outcome goes is secondary right now. You focus what you control on your body. Yes. You told me bouncing, split step, and take back, right? Yes. So, do those three parts as good as you can, consistently. Okay? And then I correct the other parts as we're going along. Okay? Yeah. Go. Very good. Go. Very good. Go. 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 Okay. Now you did about 10 to 12 balls the three parts you mentioned. Yes. I want to add one thing here, what you just practice over there. What we focus from the very close to the net area. Go forward. Okay, I want to apply it from here too. Okay. So do the three parts you mentioned. This is one part I require to move forward here with the upper body. Okay? Go. That's okay. You move forward. Go. Excellent. Go. Very nice. Go. Okay. Go. Hold on. Do you get tired? No. Okay. Uh, when you move now forward, I want you to stay a lot lower. You're coming okay. to straight a little bit. I want to see more activation with your legs. Go. Stay low. Very nice. Go. Balance, balance. Slow down a little bit. Go. Better balance. Go. Excellent. Go again. Go. That was where you want to, you did not look the ball, you move forward. That's the end result. The first 10 balls you hit, you did not move forward. Reminder, the good information. When you bounce, tell me one key word you want to focus to make it even better. Maybe like hit the ball, uh, like more in the center of the racket. More to the center, okay. I want you to focus to get more, get your racket, get your racket out, hold it, hold it properly. When you come here and try to brush, you play top spin. Okay. So I want to put more spin to the ball. Okay. It now comes a little bit too straight. You drop and go quick this part. So if I have the racket half, I want to hit the second half of your racket, the ball, to come okay. here. Okay. Do you understand this part? Yes. Okay, but you have to be able to do this a little bit. Relaxing the fingers. Okay? Yes. Understand? All right, show me. So I want you to, when you bounce, I want you to say, Spin, spin, spin. Okay. Spin, spin, spin. Go. Spin. Very good. The ball is rotating and kicking up. Spin, spin. Go. Very good. Keep your left arm straight. Spin. Go. Spin. Okay. Drop your racket for more spin. Spin. Go. Spin. Very nice. Go faster. Spin. Spin. Go. Very good top spin. Good job. Go. Spin. Very good top spin. Good job. Can you go faster, your racket? Yeah. With more spin? Spin. Spin. Go. It's okay. You put spin, yes? Spin. Go. Spin. I love it. Very good sound. Spin. Go. Spin. Very good. More. Drop it. Relax the fingers. Spin. Go. Spin. Very good. Spin. Go. Very good. Spin. Fast acceleration. Spin. Go. Spin. Amazing. Do you feel good about it? Yeah. Why you feel good? 
because I put lots of top spin. Yes. And it went kind of like at the service line. A three quarter angle, yeah. right? And the ball bounced a little higher because yes. you have good clearance over the net. When you do that shot consistently, you have less mistakes and you control the ball where it's going. We want you to control the situation, not the opponent controlling you. I want you to get water, I want you to relax, clear your head now, clear, okay? okay. Don't think too much now, it's time okay. for you to decompress. It's a lot of information there, but it's details. We try to reinforce the good information, also add one or two informations at a time, so for them to be excited to do something different, not the ordinary. So when you do something unique for their own selves, they feel like, oh, I'm getting better. Oh, I'm trying something different like that nobody else can do it. For them, it's like, you know, some triggering in a good way, excitement throughout the practice. For sure, without injuring themselves. I don't want to use too much wrist and hurt themselves. I don't want to be only spinning the ball. But we try to give variety. I liked how uh, it made like that sound that uh, when you spin, I like three angle cross court shot. And I liked how I did a take back, like right after I saw where the ball was going. And I liked how I didn't do a take back in the air. I liked how I was bouncing and my split step.